Hello, Namaste, and welcome in the series of Cybersecurity. This side is Meena, and today I'm just going to discuss about what is high availability and how you can achieve it, and what are the benefits of it. High availability is a one of the core foundation of cybersecurity. Okay, whatsoever the resources we are having, whether that's hardware so at software base, when we need it it must be accessible it must be available okay so how just we can achieve it and what are those type and benefits i'm just discuss high availability we can achieve at the hardware level okay for example we are having a server clear and this server is just serving so many users okay so here is on our dmz side for example this is dmz and here is we are having a web server here and so many users over the internet accessing it and here are lot of uh, we can say products our company is showing and users from different areas are purchasing those products and if any kind of attack will happen on it okay or if at hardware level if uh, there is some damage will come on that particular server that means users will not be able to access it anymore so we need a uh, one more or two more it depends upon how much is the load okay or it also depends upon on different different locations wise we can also place our uh, devices at different different locations okay so uh, it's uh, for example one of the server is in africa so the user in africa will access the server which is in nearby to them okay and for example one server we are having in india so servers who are who, the user who will connect from india they will access the server in which is allocated in india okay and if uh, some uh, attack will happen or some damage will uh, be on uh, or one server then the traffic can be redirected to the other server okay so high availability we can achieve another is uh, at software or the application layer we can say uh, if we are having a software or the application we are running on certain de devices if that damage then we must also have the backup plan for it how how just we are going to achieve so quickly so that the our dev devices can be available or we are having server which is having uh, simultaneously application on other, on other devices as well so if one uh, for example you can see in this diagram there are uh, seven servers and that's clustered in a one uh, as a one server when the request is coming from the internet or from the outsider that are distributed over the servers okay it's depend upon source ip or dest destination ip or on the specific operating system or specific locations how that's doing the load balancing it's depend upon what we are performing clear so if any any of uh, the server for example this server will be down then the traffic load will be distributed in among the rest of the devices okay and uh, data redundancy we can achieve we have the data for example say uh, we have a data server over there we are uh, having such data in, in in a server and in case if our data will be lost or encrypted by the cyber criminals with the ransomware okay then how just we are going to achieve it definitely we must have some uh, data over the other devices as well at the off site we can have or in the another uh, part of the network we can have it clear so it will be provided at when we need it so quickly clear sometime uh, even 
we are we just have the redundancy along with the service provider as well we are having one of the service provider and if that service providers out of service due to any xyz reason then how just we are going to continue our business then definitely we can for example this is isp1 okay we can also have the connection from the isp2 we can uh, distribute our traffic from both of the the isp or we can have uh, the primary isp which is having the high high speed uh, uh, link or on another side we are also using as a backup link so when we talk about availability means by hook and crook we need to think about each and every aspect of it we need to think the worst situation if any kind of attack will happen whether that's created by the cyber criminals or by the environmental or any damage of the devices then how just we are gonna to achieve the high availability okay there are a lot of benefits it will uh, continue our business reputation and growth of our business so we need to achieve the high availability clear and follow me on the cyber security bridge and get the notification for the next interesting and informative session also share that to your uh, that session with your friends or group members as well so that they will able to understand what is high availability how you can achieve and what are the benefits of it and in the next session i will discuss about what is api okay so see you in the next session namaste